Hey, what is going on, guys? T. Sports 15 here, and today we have the very last episode of this Minnesota Twins simulation franchise. Uh, so we're gonna finish up the simulation here, and then we're gonna do the playoffs. And uh, no matter what happens in the playoffs, this is gonna be the last season of this franchise. I'm stating that. I've been stating that since the start of last off season, um, and we are looking good to win this Central Division. So we lose the first two against Boston, but then we pick up the third game. Uh, so we have back-to-back -back series against the teams that are really close to us in the division. Um, KC and then uh, Cleveland. So we're just going to simulate them all at once. Uh, it's going to be like a six game series. We lose the first game. Uh, we win the second. There we go. And uh, we lose the third. So we get lose two or three against uh, KC. But uh, we lose the first two against Cleveland. And this is not looking good. But we win the third one. Uh, so we lose two or three against Cleveland. So another series here against KC. Win the first one, 6 0. That's a big victory. Lose the second one. Come on, let's win back to back games here. We win this one and uh, we win the fourth one. So we are back up to an eight game lead over Kansas City. So that's big. Um, I just want to check this quick. Four hits. We They only have four hits. So now we have a series here against Detroit, who's really fallen out of it. They are 15 games back of the division. But we lose the first one, uh, we lose the second one. And we lose the third one. So we're seven games ahead of Kansas City now. Um, so we have a series here against Seattle. This one doesn't have that much impact. But we still need to win these games here. So we win the first and second one. And then we lose the third one. So we win that series. Um, this one was a shutout. Yeah. So uh, series here against Ta I mean Texas Rangers. We lose the first one. We've been losing a lot of games here. We win the second one. And uh, we lose the third one. So we've been losing a lot of series here. But we're still six and a half games back ahead of the uh, Kansas City Royals. Uh, so series here on the road in Baltimore. Uh, we win the first game 8-4. to four, uh, Lose the second one. Um, and then we win the th the getaway game or whatever. So a uh, series here against Boston. Weak series. Um, and uh, the minor league playoffs are done. Neither team made it. So that's I don't really care that much. But uh, we sweep off the Boston Red Sox. That's pretty big right there. Um, and that will give us an eight-game lead over Kansas City. Uh, so we really have one series left against Cleveland. Uh, well, two series left against Cleveland and then one against Kansas City. So we'll simulate to the end of this Cleveland series. Uh, we have a series here against Toronto. We lose the first three. And uh, we win the last one, so we don't get swept. But uh, we win two of three against Cleveland. That's pretty big. Um, and we're six games ahead of Kansas City, so we should be able to uh, pick up this series, this uh, Central Division. But uh, we win three of four against the White Sox. Now a series here against Kansas City. Let's win three here. Uh, but we lose two of three there. Uh, so now we are five games ahead of Kansas City, and they still have a ch uh, shot at it. But there's three series left. If we can beat Cleveland here, we we win two of three there against Cleveland. Uh, sorry, this one right here. Yeah, three hits. Uh, so we're six and a half games ahead of them, um, and we are like seven, six games left. So I think if we win like one more, then we clinch this playoff spots. And uh, I think that should be good. Yeah, we clinched the division, guys. So uh, for the first year in a long time, we actually are not the wild card spot. So uh, we win two of three there, two of four there. We split it with Detroit, and we finished at 90 and 72. So this is gonna be the last episode of this series, guys. Sad to see to come to an end, but uh, let's make let's go with a bang, guys. Let's beat these Boston Red Sox. Uh, so yeah, the lineup pretty much the same. Just put Zanino in there. Um, same thing here. Put Zanino in there. Zanino. Zanino. Yeah, I got to get you in there for all of them. So let's go. Let's win this World Series, guys. We're simulating it one game at a time. First game in Boston. Let's go. We beat them 12-4. to 4. Um, we had 13 hits. They had 10. We had one error. They had none. Um, who else? Okay, Alex Hansen had a three-hit game. Um, Zanino had a home run. Um, for them, a couple guys had two-hit games. Ellsbury had a double. Josh Tolley, um had a home run. What is Josh Tolley overall? I wonder. Well, let's go check. Josh Tolley. He's up to an 86. That's kind of weird. He's kind of terrible in real life. Uh, so game two still in Boston. Let's pick up this victory, guys. Galito pitching, and we win three to two. Um, so we had three runs, eight hits, and one error. They had two runs, nine hits, and no errors. Uh, so uh, I think Sano had a three-hit game. Um, Sano had a double as well as Tavares. Uh, Tavares had an error. 
um, for them. Uh, Suspedis had a three-hit game. Suspedis and Ellsbury both had doubles, and Suspedis had a home run. Galito got the win, Bailey got the hold, and Henry got the save, and then Malone got the loss. So that is how game two played out. So we can win this series here on at on our home turf here in Minnesota. Bundy pitching against Felix Dubron. Let's win it here, boys. And we lose this game 10-2. to two. Uh, So they had 10 hits, 10 runs, 13 hits, and no errors. Um, and we had two runs, seven hits hits and one error uh, so we had they had Middlebrooks and Roach had three hits each uh, Suspedis and Santa Stanton had uh, two had our doubles sorry um, and then Ellsbury had a home run um, and then for us pretty much just one hit games uh, Sano had a home run and Ebreu had a double um, and then Sano got caught stealing Dubron got the win and Bundy got the loss so we have to win one of these next two games here. So Hultson pitching, then Skaggs. Uh, so Hultson, let's win it. Oh, and we lose seven to one. So they had seven runs on seven hits and one error, and uh, we had one run on five hits, no errors. Um, they both uh, Suspedis and Roach both had two hit games. Roach had a double. Suspedis had a home run, and Johnson had two home runs. Um, Middlebrooks made their error. Suspedis got caught stealing. Um, and then pretty much just one hit games for us. Myers went deep. Abreu had a double. Um, and then Profile had a stolen base. Webster went a complete game. Um, he went all nine innings. Uh, gave one run. He got the win. Um, and then Holtzen got the loss. Uh, he went five innings. So we move on to the final game of the series. Tyler Skagg is pitching. Um, should we go with Skaggs or should we put... Uh, our ace in there it is the last game so we are going to put in our ace um ian kennedy so this is a must win game ian kennedy against tommy malone let's go let's win this series there we go finally got some luck in my favor uh so we won this game here we won the series six to one um the series we went all five games so we win this game um, we had six runs on nine hits, no errors, and the Red Sox had one run on four hits, no errors. Uh, so they had a couple guys with two hits. Sano, well, we had a couple guys with two hits. Sano and Tavares had two hits each. Uh, Profire had a double. Abreu had a triple. Sano had two home runs, and Tavares had a home run himself. Stolen base for Buxton, cost ceiling for Buxton, Profar. Um, and then for them, Ramirez had a two-hit game. Uh, Brock Holt had a double, and Middlebrooks went deep. Kennedy went all nine innings and got the victory, uh, so it was smart to pitch him. Uh, Malone uh, got the loss. Um, he went four innings, uh, so that was it for that series. So um, we're going to check and see how everybody's stamina is. I'm not going to play this game. I'm just going in uh, to check. So Ian Kennedy could probably pitch game two. Yeah, he probably pitched game two. So um, we're going to go reset these like this. So Galito like that. Uh, so yeah, game one in LA. We don't have home field advantage once again. So it's going to be Lucas Galito against Cody Buckley. Buckle. So um, should be a good series here. Well, let's go. Game one. We win it 11-2. to two. That's a convincing victory, guys. So uh, we win this game 11-2. Uh, to two. We had 11 runs on 12 hits, one error. The Angels had two runs on nine hits, one error. So this is a convincing victory. Profar and Perkins both had two hit games as well as Myers and Zanino. Um, Hernandez and Zanino both had doubles. And then Profar had a home run. And then Myers had two home runs. Um, Myers had the error. Profar had a stolen base. And Tavares had a caught stealing. And then for them, Winker had a two-hit game. Um, Trumbo had a two-hit game as well as Ploof. Um, and then Ploof had a double. Trumbo had a triple. Winker had a home run. Um, and then Butcher made their error. And then Anderson got caught stealing. Galito got the win. And Kramer got the save. Uh, Galito went seven innings. Buckle got the loss. He only went five innings. Um, and that's pretty much it. So we are headed to game two still in um, L.A. It's going to be Ian Kennedy, our ace, against Chris Tillman. I just want to check, make sure his stamina is good uh, because, yeah, his stamina should be good. So we have Kennedy, then Bundy. Let's just make sure that Kennedy will be good. So we're going to hold off on – actually, let's see. So Kennedy – 
yeah, if we need him to pitch late in the series, he can. So we're just going to keep hold off on Kennedy for another game uh, just to make sure he's 100%. So we're going to pitch Bundy. Uh, he got the loss last time he pitched, but uh, hopefully he can turn it around against Chris Tillman uh, and the LA Angels. So game two, we win it 9-8. to eight. Uh, So we, it was a close game. Went, uh, we actually, they got one run in the last inning. So, um... Uh, we scored nine runs on 14 hits, one error. They scored eight runs on eight hits and one error. Um, Hanson had a two-hit game. Perkins had a two-hit game. Sano had a three-hit game, as well as Myers had a three-hit game. Um, and then Zanino had a two-hit game. So Perkins had a double. Perkins had a home run, as well as Zanino had a home run. Zanino made an error. Um, and then Sano stole a base, and Hanson got caught stealing. Uh, for them, just pretty much one-hit games, except for Anderson had a two-hit game. Anderson had a double. Home runs for Butcher, Borges, and S. S. S sorry. Espinoza, sorry, I couldn't really uh, pronounce that for a second. Espinoza had the air, and then Espinoza also got the stolen base. Uh, so Bundy started, but Shaw got the win. Bailey got a hold, as well as Kramer, and then Hembry got the save. Um, and then for them, Tillman started, went four innings, but then Quezda got the loss. Um, he went two and two-thirds. Uh, so we do pick up the victory there in game two. So we head home for three games, uh, three games set here in Minnesota. So if we can win the first two here, we can sweep them off and head to the World Series. But uh, that's very unlikely to happen. So here we go. Game three in Minnesota. Ian Kennedy's pitching against these LA Angels. It's going to be Ian Kennedy against James McDonald. Um, Ian Kennedy's 2-0 and in the playoffs and uh, James McDonald's 1-0. and So let's see what we can do. Ian Kennedy's our ace. Let's go. There we go. Ian Kennedy picks up another victory. Actually, I think it might have been a relief pitcher that came in. Let's check. Uh, yeah, De La Rosa. Ruby De La Rosa came in. Oh, yeah. He came in for the ninth, I guess. Um, and he picked up the victory. Um, so Kennedy went seven innings. He had a pretty good game, but we just couldn't score many runs. Um, Smith got the loss. Um, Hanson had a stolen base. Perkins had an error. Um, Tavares ha had a double as well as Myers. And then, yeah, so you can check out that. Uh, for them, Plouffe had a triple. Winker had a home run. Plouffe had an error. Trout had a stolen base. And Butcher had a caught stealing. Um, so they scored two runs on two hits and one error. So we two hit them. Um, and then the for us, we had three runs on seven hits and one error. So we do go on to win game three. We go up 3 nothing in this series. Um, and we could win this series. Halton against Cody Buckley. Um, and we could have a lot of time to rest before the next series. So here we go. Let's go. Danny Holton, pick up your first victory of this seat of the playoffs. Let's go. There we go. And we win that game 14 to 10. A very, very big victory. And we move on to the World Series uh, in this in the, these playoffs. So we scored 10. They scored 10 runs on 15 hits, no errors. We scored uh, 14 runs on 17 hits, no errors. Uh, so for them, Board just had a three-hit game. There's a bunch of guys with two-hit games uh, because there were so many hits in this game. It was a high-scoring affair. Linder, Trout, Ploof, Borges, and Anderson all had doubles, and then Borges had a triple home run for Butcher, um, and then Butcher also had a stolen base. Uh, so a good game for Butcher. Hanson had a four-hit game. He went four for six. Um, then Profar and Perkins both had three-hit games. Tavares and Hernandez both had two-hit games. Hanson had three doubles. Um, and then Tavares had a double as well. Profar had a triple as well as Abreu. And then Tavares had a home run. Um, and then Hanson had a stolen base. Um, Buckley started it, but he didn't go. He went didn't get an out at all um he gave up eight runs all of them earned uh so then this quesda guy came in for five innings shut us down and um, they actually made a comeback and then justin grimm came in um and he got the loss after giving up two runs um for us perez got the victory so our bullpen really helped out and then andrew bailey got the three inning save so halton went three innings perez went three innings and then bailey went three innings so a very nice performance by our pitching staff and we're moving on to the world series to face the it looks like the dodgers but uh they're up three nothing in the series they actually sweep off the mets uh, so we're going to reset our uh, pitching rotation um and uh, it's gonna it looks like kennedy's gonna start there then it's gonna be galito Bundy, then Skaggs. We're going to give Skaggs an actual chance. So it's going to be uh, Kennedy first game, then Galito, Bundy, Hultz, and Skaggs. So that's going to how this works. Um, so game one is going to be Ian Kennedy against Clayton Kershaw. And it's going to be a good series, guys. 
we're taking on the LA Dodgers. Let's just go quickly, check their lineup, see who they got um, before we start. So pitching rotation, they have Kershaw, Morgan, Perez, Reed, um, Bird. So our rotation is better than theirs. Um, actually, they don't, they don't even have this 91 overall in the big. So it's going to be Kershaw, Perez, Reed, Bur Reed, McGill, and then Chatwood. So they really don't have a good rotation, uh, not even comparable to ours. In their bullpen, they have Johnny Venters. Uh, Guerrera and Tolson. Um, yeah, so that's their bullpen right there. And then they have lit their closure is not that good either. I can't even pronounce that name. Their catcher is pretty good. Tehran. Um, their first baseman is not as, as good as ours. Altuve is their second baseman. He's pretty good. Uh, third base, uh, Chutbert. Uh, he's not that good. Um, shortstop Peterson, he's not that good. He's 88 overall. Lucas Duda, he's terrible in left field. Kemp's down to an 87. Um, and then Jason Hayward's down to an 87. So these guys don't even have that good of a team. Um, it's just going to be tough facing Clayton Kershaw in game one. But after that, we should be good. So we have home field advantage because we won the All-Star game. So in these playoffs, this is our first time having the home field advantage. So let's go. Let's win game one matchup of the aces kennedy against kershaw let's go we win game one three to nothing we shot them out we shot them out guys um so they had five hits one error with no runs we had three runs five hits no errors uh so we actually had a very good game for them tehran had two hit game um nobody had extra base hits for them at all um Chuttenbert got an error. Hayward got a stolen base. Um, and then we just had one hit games. And then Profar and Snow went had home runs each. Kershaw got his first loss of the playoffs. He went six innings. He gave up all three runs. Um, and then Kennedy went all nine innings uh, and picked up the victory, his third victory of the playoffs. So a very nice game one. Ian Kennedy's having like a career playoffs, man. So Galito is going to pitch game two against Martin Perez. Um, and I just want to check how uh, Ian Kennedy's stamina is. Uh, so, because we're probably going to need to pitch him once again in this series. So, he actually has, like, pretty decent stamina. We do have this game, then an off day. So, he probably will be able to pitch by, like, here or here. Uh, so, we will probably get another chance to have him pitch. So, Lucas Galito is going to pitch against Martin Perez. Uh, Galito is 2-0 with a 2.51 ERA, and then uh, Perez is 1-0 with a 2.77 ERA. So both pitchers have pitched well through these playoffs, but hopefully we can get the best of them here in Game 2. Let's go. And we win. We win 8-7 here. Richie Perez comes off uh, the bench and pitches for us. Uh, and we do pick up the victory. He got the vic he got the victory. Uh, so Altuve had a two hit game. Peterson had a two hit game. Um, Duda had a two hit game. Um, and then Kemp had a two hit game. So Peterson and Duda had home runs for them. Um, and then that's pretty much it for those stats. By the way, they they had seven runs on ten hits, no errors, and we had eight runs on ten hits, no errors. So one run difference, very close game. Um, Sano had a two hit game, and then Abreu had a, a four hit game. He went four for four. Um, Sano, Myers, and Abreu had two doubles. Well, okay, Sano and Myers had one double, and then Abreu had two doubles. Um, Abreu had two stolen bases, so Abreu had a huge game here. He really carried this team. Four hit game, four four, two doubles, and two stolen bases. Um, and then Perez got the loss for them, and then Perez got the win for us. Uh, Kramer got the hold, and then uh, Hembry got his third save of the playoffs. So we're looking good here, guys. Headed into game three, headed to L.A. for three games in L.A. And if we can win two of three here um, while we're in L.A., we can win uh, the World Series. So Bundy against Chris Reed. Let's go. Oh, yes, sir. We are up 19 to 8. We win that game 19 to 8. Huge victory. Um, we had 19 runs on 20 hits, one error, and they had eight hit eight runs on 15 hits and no errors. So huge game here, guys. We go up three nothing in the series. And if we win the next game, uh, we can win this World Series, guys, in the last time I'm gonna be playing um this franchise. So Profar had a two hit game, Tavares had a two hit game, Perkins had a two hit game, um Myers had a three hit game, Abreu had another four hit game, um Bundy had a two hit game as a pitcher, um and then some guys came off the bench to have some hits. So Abreu had a double, Zanino had a double, Hernandez had a triple, Abreu had two home runs. Abreu is having 
a lifelong dream, man. He had two home runs here in this game. Marte had a home run. Sano had an error, but he also stole a base. So he made up for it. Uh, for them, Altuve had a three-hit game. Peterson had a three-hit game. Um, Teradak. Gick had a two-hit game. Duda had a two-hit game. Chut Burt had a two-hit game. Kemp had a two-hit game. And uh, that is that for them. Um, Hayward had a double as well as Tara Dotkick and uh, Duda. Um, and then Chut Burt had a home run. Altuve got caught stealing. Bundy went five innings, but he did get the victory. Um, and then Robbie Ross got the hold. And then nobody got saved because we won by a very hefty margin, um, 11 runs. So their starter, Reed, only went two innings, and he did get the loss. And uh, we are still in um, L.A., but we have to face their ace, Clayton Kershaw, against um, Danny Hulton, uh who hasn't been pitching that well. So I'm actually going to give the nod to... Tyler Skaggs, who hasn't pitched through these playoffs, but he, I think he had a very good, uh, uh, very good season. Uh, so we're gonna just check this uh, quickly. So this is the plan for the rest of this series. Um, we're going to pitch Tyler Skaggs, then Hulton, um, and then we're just gonna keep this going. Um, and then we're going to pitch somebody else, um, whoever's next in the order in game this game right here, game six. Um, and then if it does end up going to game seven, that's when we're gonna use our best pitcher, Ian Kennedy. So we're not gonna use Ian Kennedy until it is an elimination game. Now that we are up three nothing, but hopefully we can win the World Series here. Uh, in game five, in game four, sweep them off right here. Let's go. Tyler Skaggs against Clayton Kershaw. Let's go. Press an X right now. And we win the World Series, guys. Tyler Skaggs, right decision to put him on the mound. Um, we had seven runs on eight hits, no errors. They had two runs on eight hits, no errors. And uh, this series is done, guys. We do win the World Series. So this is the last episode of this Twins franchise. There's going to be lots of videos on this today. Uh, so we pretty much everybody had one hits except for Tyler Skaggs had a two hit game. Um, Skaggs had a double. Tavares and Sano and Zanino all had home runs. Uh, Tavares and Perkins both had a stolen base each. Um, that's it for that. So Altuve had a four hit game. Um, Kemp had a two hit game. Um, and that's pretty much it for them. Um, and then Altuve, Kemp, Televac kick and him had a two had doubles and then Teheran Tehan um, had a stolen base and a caught stealing Tyler Skaggs uh, got the victory he went eight innings strong uh, only gave up two runs both of them were earned and then Kershaw only went five innings and he gave up three runs he got the loss and then they used most of their bullpen uh, for the rest of the game so we do win the World Series guys that will be it for this series guys Hopefully you did enjoy this entire series. Um, I think I had five videos out today, so that's a lot. It's going to be a lot to render and upload and everything, but I'll try and get that all done uh, for tomorrow. And uh, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for supporting this whole series through the whole way. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.